Hi everyone, how are you all? So I'm finally back on my channel after so many weeks. I know I have been MIA for the last couple of weeks. So sorry for that. Today's video is gonna be a first impressions video on the LA Girls Pro Coverage HD Illuminating Foundations. I was sent these products like a month ago but I didn't get the proper time to you know review and film them and do the compression and all. So much hype around these days and they are so affordable like 1100 to 1200 or so and they are really really cheap I think for a foundation. What I got was natural. Uh, I felt this shade might be slightly darker for my skin tone so I asked them to send me another one which is in this white. What you do is if you found a dark shade for yourself you can always mix a little bit of this so you know your foundation gets a bit lighter and it exactly matches to your skin tone. I want to give it a try today and do a first impression video and see if this works for me or not. I'm taking my artist palettes by Power Painters Ring Palette. They are amazing and economical guys. Like you have to make your hands dirty or anything. Just put the product foundation over here and work your way out. This comes in this packaging. It's kind of really similar to the Makeup Forever one. Although I don't have that. But I have heard it's kind of a cheap dupe for that. That is a plus guys. It has this cap and it opens up. It has a pump. I'm just gonna be shaking some of the product and applying this on the okay so I have like this much on the foundation is thick to runny it's not very thick it's not very runny so it comes something in between I feel this can be a little dark for me so I can always use the white one let's see how this works I'll be taking like one little pump of this because it might you know it might really brightens my foundation like this I hope you can see this I have like add a little droplet of that in my finger and mixing both the shades together okay a nice smell I saw a lot of different videos on YouTube the youtubers were kind of complaining that it doesn't smell good the essence doesn't smell good but I think it smells nice not pretty as bad it's kind of covering my whole face pump of the foundation and I've applied it on my face. Let's see how the coverage is. Now I'm taking a damp beauty blender. I'm gonna blend out this foundation and let's see how it goes. like medium coverage foundation but I'm sure we can build this up more if I take like more product but I'm pretty satisfied how the foundation look like it doesn't really feel heavy on my skin uh, it feels light and it definitely gives a, a dewy finish on my face a dewy finish like a lot of dewy finish it definitely gives you a nice glow like nice glowing skin has nicely absorbed in my skin and I don't feel cakey at all like this was the result in just one application so I'm taking some more of the foundation and testing out a little more
like the formula so far the texture is very smooth and it was easy to blend in my face and it kind of absorbed the whole product this foundation is gonna work for me like a dewy kind of finish on my skin but this foundation definitely gives a glow not just that dewiness like your face looks kind of wet but it glows which is a plus for me so I'm gonna go and do my full makeup so I'll tell you my final verdict in like few minutes guys I'm back and it's been an hour since I've been applying this foundation now I'll be giving my final verdict about this product now this foundation is amazing for its price I mean you get such good coverage it's kind of medium to full coverage like it you can build the coverage it doesn't one or two layers of foundation won't harm your skin it won't look like your skin is cakey or anything I really like how the finish is I mean it makes my face look complete and I don't see any kind of uh, imperfections or anything for people who have dry skin, combination to dry skin or combination to oily skin, I think you should definitely give it a go since it gives a dewy finish which is a plus for people who have dry skin. They are suckers for such illuminating skin. Oily skin people, I would recommend that you're the kind of person who likes very matte to satin finish kind of look. Like I do personally as well. I have a tip for you as well. Uh, if you do not want too much dewiness out of this foundation, I would recommend you guys to wear a setting powder which is which gives you a matte finish. Elegal one also has like a very nice matte mattifying powder I would recommend you guys to get that as well if you're investing in this foundation right now I'm wearing Rimmel Stay Matte's uh, pressed powder and my face is fixed and I don't see a lot of dewiness going around my face like uh, just the way I want uh, minimal minimal and stuff like product at the end is a go for a dry skin person or who has a combination skin guys that was my final verdict about the foundation I totally liked it I would rate it as 4 out of 5 and uh, I would definitely use it more and I recommend you guys to go for it yes definitely it's a good product it's a reasonable product I mean what do you get in this price range it is only for rupees 11 to 1200 and you can easily invest in something like that I hope you found this video helpful in any way so if you like this video then do give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like that if you enjoy watching such first impressions kind of you know tryouts type of things then do mention that in the comments below I would try to do more kind of these drugstore uh, foundation first impression sort of stuff yeah guys see you in my next video very soon till then bye